Sometimes I'd think I was unique, you know, years ago. But I'm not. I'm ordinary. Nothing happened till after Daphne was born. For some reason, I got on the wrong train, but it was the right direction, more or less, so I stayed on standing up. Suddenly, I felt two or maybe three fingers touching me very lightly. Every time the train stopped, more people got out. A great draft of air came in from the platform, and I felt cold. It was Gunnell's Bristation, Station, which isn't too far from me, so I got out. I didn't dare look back, but I heard the footsteps behind me. That was the first time when I was very cold at the back of some row of shops called Something Parade by the Midland Bank. If I wasn't married, I'd have done it all the time, one to another, I suppose. But I don't think so. It's never been what I've wanted. Oh, not that I haven't behaved. It... They're right to get me, people like me. Hilda never knew about Dennis, about giving him up. I gave him up, you see. He, he threatened to telephone me or write to me, but he hasn't. Do you still want to give him up? No. What about the police? Only had one brush with the police before Turnham Green. He flashed his torch on as he let the other one go, but he took my name and address and made me meet him the next night. Only about three times. Oh, I know you think I haven't tried, but... I can't make any more effort anymore. I want to plead guilty. Well, you can't. Now go on. He asked me for light, this other policeman in Piccadilly Tube Station. Was he, was he in plain clothes? Naturally. I knew it was going to happen. Sounds camp, but then the truth so often is. He was quite young, younger than I am, with lots of brown wavy hair. Like mine used to be just when I went in the army, before I met Hilda. 